Elizabeth National Park is one of Uganda's most popular tourist destinations. Covering an area of 1,978 square kilometers, it attracts visitors from all over the world who come in the hope of seeing some of the 66 different animals and 568 different bird species that inhabit the park. Queen Elizabeth National Park itself, actually it goes to, uh, to 1,978 kilometers squared. That is the big, uh, actually it is the second park to Machison Falls. And uh, mainly the animals that we have here, we only have uh, mammals. We have 95 animal species that we have in Queen Elizabeth National Park. Queen Elizabeth National Park sits on the equator in the shadow of the Renzori Mountains with rivers and waterfalls providing an essential source of water. Lake Edward and Lake George, connected by the Kazinga Channel, also provide ideal opportunities for boat rides within the park. There are accommodation options for all budgets in and around the park. The hostels are kept busy catering to the needs of their different clients. Our place is uh, close to many tourist uh, attractions. Uh, we have uh, Queen Elizabeth National Park, which is about uh, three, kilo, three kilometers from our hotel. Uh, we have uh, we are close to Mount Ruenzori, which is a bit also like about five kilometers from here. We have a, we are close to Kirembe Mines, which is about one kilometer from the here. Hippos, buffaloes, waterbuck, lions, elephants and baboons are just some of the mammals you can expect to see on a visit to Queen Elizabeth. But it is not just the wildlife that makes this region special. The area surrounding Queen Elizabeth National Park is green and full of vegetation. Ankole tea plantation still provides jobs for many, with tea being exported all over the world. <laughs> Many people make a living inside Queen Elizabeth National Park itself, with fishing and salt mining helping local communities to support themselves. Every, every, every human being here who stays around at least must be having, I think you can even see those square square things. So it means every person is having his own uh, portion where he extracts the salt from. Kazinga Channel Fishing Village is busy all year round. As the sun rises in the morning, fishermen set sail, heading out to the water to begin their day's work. Queen Elizabeth National Park is about more than just wildlife. Communities here live peacefully alongside the animals that bring so many tourists to their doorstep.